There you go in there. You taking a photo on your old camera. You're in my shot. You're in my shot? <laughs> Get out of my shot. Get out of my shot! Uh, uh. Am I still in your shot? No. Oh, hey guys, we are actually under the pier in St Kilda. It's like the weekend before Christmas and um, yeah, we're just going to take some cool shots. Taylor's got her Voilander and we also have a new camera which we are going to show you soon. Um, it's a 120. Oh, no. Yeah, she got her feet wet. Oh, so um, anyway, wet. hope you enjoy watching. It's just going to fuck around for the day, aren't we? Yes. Did you get some shots? I'm wet too. You may be wet. Pick up the rust on this thing. Okay, right. So much rust. Yeah. Alrighty, we've just come across this um, pavilion, which is built here in 1904 and like burned down in 2003 as a kiosk. So, um, yeah, we're going to take some photos of now. Round window, get some of the wood textures in there, maybe a bit of sky in the background, see how it comes up on film. So I've just got it set to like 15 feet, um, 25th of a second, um, shutter speed, and yeah, F6. So here, 1904, it was like this couple that flew flags for the weather predictions, and then 1930s, it was a kiosk, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yep. And then it was a kiosk from 39 to 89, and it burnt down in 03. Oh, the timber here was rebuilt in concrete during the 70s, and yeah, these cool old photos. You felt nice, right? God damn, that ice cream was good. Now we are going to go take a photo of Luna Park on film. Sorry guys, I don't know what came above me. Um, we, we're just at Luna Park, and yeah, we're gonna try and get some more cool old shots. So we've got the big open mouth to take a photo of. That's pretty cool, if you ever hear, you can do that. And hopefully they've got the, like, the, the parameter roller coaster on, which, was, which is like the old one that they have to stand on. That's fully sick. I don't know why they don't do it all the time, because danger's good and shit. Um, so yeah, we'll see how we go now. Shots at St Kilda, went to Luna Park, actually got a bit sick, nearly, <laughs> nearly got a bit sick. We didn't really eat much, so yeah, it's been, it's been eaten. Now we're just off to the Melbourne Observation Wheel, and then finally, we're going to show you our new camera when we get back. Where's the fluke? There it is. Ah, woof. There's the Costco sign. Oh, yeah, and people eating in it. Yeah. Uh, there's a drone over there. We're about a uh, quarter of the way up on the Melbourne Observation Wheel, and there's a drone on us. So that's pretty cool. So if you hear this, I want to see this footage of me. Really easily, yeah. 
Yeah. What's your reckon? Got Marvel Stadium right there. There's Taylor. <laughs> Chinese lady taking photos. Step. Start turning? Yeah. Oh, I inserted my two dollars early. I hadn't selected my thing. I'll probably get the one I don't want. <laughs> Just got back, well, it's a couple days later, but anyway, back from our trip, and I'm finally showing this, showing you this cool camera. Um, it's a brownie box camera, Kodak brownie reflex. Um, I think they started getting made in 1941, don't quote me on that, because that's what Google said. Um, takes 110 film. What? It's not 110, it's 127. Oh, sorry. Takes 127 film, not 110. Um, the way that Taylor got it is she's getting known as to be the camera collector at work and stuff. So someone just bought it in for her and she was like, yeah, as a junkie does. So um, still got the like awesome like wax paper kind of box cover and the instructions. I'll show you them a bit more close up in a sec. That's the bottom of the box. And this is the camera. So it's got the, I don't know what it's called. Is it like a refractor lens or something? But like where you look down here, and I can see Taylor recording me, and you can probably see it if you look in here, you can probably see me. And um, yeah, so it's really hard to get film for these. And the 127 film, a lot of people cut down 120 film to 127, but that seems a bit... Well, we can film anyway at Michael's Cameras. I think this is, what, 20 bucks for how many shots is it? 12. 20 bucks for 12 shots, which is kind of dear, but kind of cool as still. So. Yeah, let's put this in. Wait, that's spool. Oh, that one's already got a spool. So the camera filming might be a little bit wonky. So, right, that's how I expose because it says start. No, it should be fine. And it goes in one way. And then once that's in. We have to lock that. You lock that, that's right. Now turning the winding knob and watch the red window. 
First you'll see a warning hand, then dots, then a number one. Stop when one is central in the window. Dot, 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 one. Oh cool, it's upside down. Yeah, I think it is in your Voigtlander too, isn't it? Nope. Huh. Anyway, so yeah, to take this shot, you just look down that thing. Hello! <laughs> uh, yeah, gonna take a photo of the Christmas tree. And um, so you've got to look down this thing. It's kind of like those old submarine peakers where you look down and it looks another way. So like everywhere I move, I can see the frame in here. It's like reverse. So if I want the tree to go left, I've got to go to the left. I don't know. Anyway, ready? First picture ever. I did it. <laughs> oh, no. Put it in the envelope. Write your name on it and bring a penny. Can't forget the penny. 